Hi, I'm Shay. Hey, I'm Anna. <laughs> and we are People Food Editors, and every week we get new food and beverages that are just about to hit store shelves, and we're gonna try them out first and tell you what's worth it. And this week, because it's right after Memorial Day, we wanted to kick off summer with some hard seltzers, hard teas, hard lemonades. We're having a few drinks. Woo woo! <laughs> Maybe these hard seltzers can make you feel like you're on a tropical vacation. We'll see. Some of these flavors definitely will do that. And these are all new flavors um, from a bunch of different brands. So should we kick it off? I'm ready. Okay, well, we have Loverboy, which is the cast of Summer House. Should we start with them? That's kind of fun. What's calling me is the, the hibiscus palm. All right, let's stick, um, start that. It has a cute little pink bottle. They have like really cute packaging. Very scary. <laughs> Love that sound. That's the sound of summer right there. Um, I'm going to put it on ice. I always drink my hard seltzers on ice. The, the aroma hits you the second that you pop that lid. Um, I'm trying it. Um, for me, the flavor is a little aggressive. Do you agree? Honestly, not getting a lot of hibiscus. Just tastes like pomegranate juice. I actually kind of like it. Um, not so for you. Tastes to me very artificial sweetenery. Mm, there's no, so there's zero sugar in it, and there's 90 calories. But it tastes very sweet. It does I oh monk? Know. They use monk fruit. Okay, well, healthier, I think. Okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. It's fine. I have to confess though, like I'm not a huge hard seltzer person and I feel like you're way more of the expert in this category. So this, I, don't, I don't really know what it's supposed to taste like so much. Um, well, I like love Twisted Tea, so like, but this is kind of like a more not so in your face. Like I can only have one Twisted Tea. I could have like three of these. Okay, so we're gonna do White Claw and White Claw is like, I feel like the pinnacle of hard yeah. seltzer. But this is different. This is not going to get you as crazy because it's low. It's lower alcohol, so you can drink them all day, and there's only 70 calories and less alcohol. All right. Three three point seven as opposed to like five, I think. All right. And let's um. I have pineapple. You try clementine. Let's see what we think. Okay. I have yeah. Okay. They come in two new flavors. Oh, that smells really good. The pineapple is so good. Oh my God. Sorry, I couldn't wait. <laughs> Weird. Okay, the clementine smells like clementine. Like, whoa, it smells really good, natural, not artificial. It tastes uh -huh. so subtle. It's like not as potent as I thought it was going to be. And I like it. I like that. You hate flavored seltzers. I, I think that what I'm realizing is I just don't like the flavor. Like, if, it, if it's too fruity, then I'm not yeah. going to like it. But I love this. You gotta try the pineapple, it's I so get good. It. Like, I'm on board with the White Claw, baby. <laughs> I knew you'd be a convert. It's my workout for today. <laughs> mm. it smells like Dole Whip. It does! <laughs> oh my God. Um, oh. I love White Claw. Okay, I'm, I'm a new person. I'm like a, I'm all on the White Claw bandwagon. Let's do the ginger lime hard seltzer from Arctic Summer. This is new too. Okay. You know polar seltzer? Do you drink a lot of this just regular smell. seltzer? I haven't even opened it. I'm just smelling <laughs> my pants. Mm -hmm. um, no, I don't. Polar seltzer is like just a brand of regular seltzer. So this is their hard version. I love polar seltzer. It's really good. Oh, um, so oh, oh polar. Yeah, okay. Yeah. It's cute packaging, and this is ginger lime, so I think it's supposed to taste like a Moscow mule. All right, I love it. And I mom. have this cute I'm little hoping. copper mug. What? Did you I just have it. that? That <laughs> is such a great little trinket. Um, I'm jealous, I wish I had one too. All right, I'm not getting ginger aroma-wise. Cheers. Oh, I get the ginger. It's not just like a lime seltzer, it's different. All right, I'm getting it. Maybe my expectations are just wrong. Cause when you said Moscow Mule, I was like, 
okay, like literally slap me in the face with some ginger, like. No, it's like in the back, it's just in the background. Which is not the point of this. And so no. I think it's a success in what it's supposed to be if I had different expectations. And now I'm gonna reset. But would you just drink a regular seltzer, hard seltzer in a can, no flavor? Would you like that? Sure, absolutely. I've definitely done that. Um, I like how drinkable it is. And I think it's great if you're not wanting to like carry a big ball of vodka or something around. It's just right. much more affordable. Anyway. Totally. All right. I need something sweet. Let's do the lemonade. All right. You're not excited. You ready? We're going to crack it open. <laughs> oh, sorry. You got me wet, Shay. <laughs> <laughs> We're so stupid. Uh, okay. Now my computer's soaked. <laughs> Good job. Occupational hazard, baby. Okay. Um, this is going to be a cool color, too. I can already tell. Blueberry lemonade. Ooh. It's fun. Like rose-colored pink. It's gorgeous. This is new-ish, right? I think this is totally new. It's a little pepto bismol color-wise. Yeah, it is. I'm gonna say but that. this brand is totally new, I think. It's Crook and Marker. Okay. They make teas and lemonades. So we're doing so what, the blueberry what, lemonade. What gives it the alcohol? It says purified water. Organic alcohol made with ancient grains. Wow, this Ooh. is very nutritional. Um, nutritious, whatever. Zero artificial flavors, zero preservatives. It just says contains alcohol. You hate it. I hate it. Nope. Sorry. I'm oh sorry. my god. I don't, say I don't like this. I don't hate anything, but. Um, I don't hate it. It's so sweet. I, it's very sweet. So but sweet. lemonade is sweet. People want sweet lemonade. Okay. The blueberry is very refreshing. And, and, so and I, it's a unique flavor combination. If I you like sweet drinks. I have a regular lemonade version. So maybe I'll like that better. Try that. That's better because it's way more tart. I'm not really getting the lemonade. Yeah, this just tastes like a blueberry beverage. That's not for me. I like the regular lemonade of theirs better though. But okay. blueberry, if you like sweet, then maybe that's your bag. Not my bag. Um, okay. It's my bag. All right, last one. The Bon Vive. Is I it Viv or Vive? Bon, bon Viv, I don't know. Bon Viv. Really cute new packaging. They put an exclamation point, so. Yeah. Oh, this is good. I know I said that about all of them, but this is like a Malibu rum, like a Malibu okay. drink. This would be really good with rum. I guess it's already alcohol. <laughs> more is better. <laughs> you can add more alcohol. Um, you know what all the kids on TikTok are doing too, is they're blending it with ice and like fruit. Whoa. Making them slushy. This would be really good. Like I that. gotta say, I've been getting really into the TikTok lately. I like this black cherry one. I don't think the black cherry is new, but um, well, all of it's new packaging. But this is the newest flavor, so get this one, even though Shay doesn't have it. I don't have it, but I wish I did. Okay, time for the rankings. Number one, White Claw. I okay, well, we it. agree on that. I want to bathe myself in it. It's so good. Ginger lime, Arctic summer, um, really refreshing. I wish it was a little bit more gingery, but other than that, like it's, I like the subtleness of it. Very drinkable. I'm a fan. Bon Viv is very close, but these are on the same pages. The lover boys and the Kirk markers are different. They're like, if you need like something sweet and flavorful, like these you could drink all day. Those are like, oh, I need a blueberry lemonade right now. You know? I will say like the lover boy knocked me over the head with its flavor. It was really aggressive. Um, mm -hmm. the, the crook and marker blueberry lemonade was 
my least favorite. Um, you liked the lemon tea from them, right? I did like the lemonade more. Oh, lemonade. You liked the lemonade, the lemonade from them. more because it was more of a tart that counteracted the sweet, but the blueberry lemonade for me, too sweet. Man, I'm losing my train of thought because I'm just loving this so much. <laughs> <laughs> can we just stay and like have a proper happy hour yeah we'll stay here you guys go buy these bye cheers guys <laughs> drink responsibly bomb bomb <laughs>